doesn't take much for our old downtown to take on a holiday appearance for Christmas. After all, 200 plus Christmases have been seen from its windows, and these old brick buildings evoke a nostalgic appearance. But a lot of times, I tell people, you should have been here. You should have been here back when Christmas in downtown Augusta was really something. A December breeze rustles the leaves along the wide old street, and traffic could not be called heavy. Newcomers to our town can't help but notice the absence of a lot of activity. They've been to the mall and shopping centers. They've experienced the traffic snarls on Wheeler and Wrightsboro and Washington roads. But downtown, they say that seems pretty quiet. I tell people, you should have been here 33 years ago, 1977. Christmas, downtown Augusta, the last great Christmas that Augusta saw. And I'll tell you about that when we get back. Christmas Day, 1977, came on a Sunday, but Christmas Eve was Saturday. And I'm here to tell you, downtown streets were packed. There were people everywhere. There were cars everywhere. Every parking spot was full. And it was really something to see. J.B. White's was there. So were Davison's, later called Macy's, and Penny's, and Belk, and Cullum's, that old Augusta favorite. Woolworth's and H.L. Green's, wonderful five and dime stores. They stood like bookends on the south side of the 800 block. In between were smaller places to eat or shop. I remember walking back to work after lunch that Christmas Eve on sidewalks full of people and children everywhere children. They all seemed so happy, so much so that even a cynical young newspaper man could be impressed. I thought it would always be like that downtown on Broad Street in the days before Christmas, but 1977 was the last. Augusta and Regency Malls opened the next summer. Those big old Broad Street department stores moved out to the suburbs and things got quiet. By the next year, Christmas 1978, the change was obvious. We did a story counting the empty storefronts. There were more than 70. Most shoppers were out at the shiny new stores in the malls. Downtown Augusta still has its Christmas lights, but people, that main ingredient of the Christmas spirit, sometimes seem to be somewhere else. That's okay, you should have been here. We all should have been here. It was a Christmas that we all need to remember. <laughs>